The act of writing, when it goes well, gives me a pleasure, a joy, unlike any other. It takes me to another place, whatever my subject, where I am totally absorbed. Author and neurologist Dr. Oliver Sacks died Sunday at his home in New York at age 82, according to the Associated Press. Born in London into a family of doctors, Dr. Sachs's work explored rare diseases and wonders of the human brain. In a video to promote his 2015 memoir, On the Move, Dr. Sachs spoke about his career as both neurologist and storyteller. Over a lifetime, I've written millions of words, but the act of writing seems as fresh and as much fun as when I started it nearly 70 years ago. Dr. Sachs began his career as a neurologist in 1966 at a hospital in the Bronx, New York. His experience treating patients who had spent years in a helpless, frozen state led him to write Awakenings, a book that detailed his discovery that treating the patients with the then-experimental drug L-DOPA reawakened them. The story was later made into an Oscar-nominated movie starring Robin Williams and Robert De Niro. Throughout his career, Dr. Sachs wrote about his interactions with people who suffered from a range of severe and sometimes bizarre neurological conditions. He was known for compassionately portraying his patients. In his 1985 book, The Man Who Mistook His Wife for a Hat, he documented the troubles of a man whose brain had difficulty interpreting what his eyes saw. I am a storyteller, for better and for worse. I suspect that a feeling for stories, for narrative, is a universal human disposition, going with our powers of language, consciousness of self, and autobiographical memory. 